and we're back. Um, all right. All right. The next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna find out where his shoes are gonna his his cowboy boots here. So we're gonna kind of cut it off right there. We'll worry about putting shaping the shoes a little bit differently. But let's do this. Spray it a little bit just to soften it up. You know, folks, a lot of times when I do these projects, I have no idea what they're going to turn out to be. Until I have an idea in my head, don't get me wrong, but a lot of times I have no idea uh, what they're going to look like or how they're, you know, how they're going to finally play out here. But, okay, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to try to bring this down. Of detail you can do with a sheriff or any one of these um, characters, uh, you know, so what, how much time you're willing to put into it, you know, really. And come across, of course, we're going to make it the same depth as it is in the front to the back. There you go. All right, so we're going to follow that. Worry about his hands and such a little bit later. Just thinking here. All right, I'm going to go back to the hat here and just kind of scoop this out. I'm going to do some of this offline because um, I want to try to get this a lot deeper than what I have it. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to spray it a little bit and use this little gouge to try to scoop it out. If you have a fine pen knife or, you know, real small, you should be able to do it as well. But I'm just going to try to save a little time, uh, my time here, by just using this. A little wider sweep would be nice, but... You know, you got to use what you have available. Uh, as far as buying tools and su such, um, I only buy really what I need. Not always um, uh, sets I have in the past, and not that set, getting a set of gouges is bad. It's just a lot of times you have use maybe two or three out of that set. Uh, they are cheaper to buy by the set, but it doesn't always mean you use everything that you buy. All right, so. Okay, we're going to put, we're going to maybe put a thing around here eventually that will separate everything. Um, I haven't figured out how I'm going to do that yet. Mm. All right. A 
I'm going to go underneath here and try to separate the arm to there. off his mustache a little bit. We're really not going to see a mouth underneath there. Now I'm going to do the same thing over here. Bring this up and around. here. Let's bring his arm up and around the back side here. Whoops. I'm going to get rid of that point because that's not going to stay there anyway, so let's just get rid of that right away. Save some headache and confusion on that. Just trying to lay out where where his legs are going to go here, and um, the Y, and see that's there. Get a general idea where it's going to match on the back end here. The nice thing about caricature is there is no right or wrong way of doing stuff. There really is not. Um, that seems a little high, so we're going to bring this down just a little bit lower. Just a tad lower. Alright. And of course he's going to have his gun.